Laid back Mickey here, and today we're gonna go over how do you store your trike? Where do you put it in your house? Can you put it in your garage? Can you hang it? Can you hook it? Well, I'm gonna tell you many different ways from my experience. Some people that have like apartments, they need a folding trike or they just have to kind of put it anywhere in their house. Can it fit through the door? Most trikes are smaller than the door. They're about 31, 32 inches. Some go to 33 and that's gonna be a little bigger than a door. So if you're gonna get a trike that fits through a door, make sure it's like a 31, 32 inch. And when you turn the wheel sideways, it can fit through the door a little easier. It'll cut it down to like a 28, 29 inch wheelbase when you turn the wheel. And that'll be a way to get it in an apartment or if you're traveling, to get it inside your hotel room. Now, a lot of people like folding trikes. So folding trikes, you can fold it up and like some like the cat trikes, they have wheels on the bottom and you could roll it around. So that's kind of cool. But if you're just looking at like, where'd I put it in my garage? My garage is all messy. Like mine was last week before I cleaned it. <laughs> well, I like to keep my trike on the ground. If you can, that's a great place to keep it because it's easy access. And then I think you'll ride it more because you just, you know, go into the garage, get on your trike and ride off. But some people don't have that luxury. Some people say, I don't have a lot of room. The next best way is to get a hook, a hook on the wall and then you hook it. Some people go, can I just use the hooks that I find down at Lowe's or Home Depot that you just screw in the wall? And my thing is probably not because it's not strong enough. I recommend the trike hanger by Terra Trike. It's a more solid uh, piece of metal with a hook. And then that one you could hook the rear wheel on and it's nice and strong. That's a great way we use around our shop. We hook our trikes around the shop on a hook if they're not on the ground. Another way for your trike is to hang your trike. You could hang your trike in the rafters from a two by four. It's kind of like you do with kayaks and then you can pull your trike up and then let your trike down. Uh, we do that with a ton of tandems. Like when I want my tandem out of the way, I just put it up in, in the rafters by pulling on the string. And let's check them out and I'll show you the different ways we store them here. Okay, so when you're storing your trike, maybe in your garage, maybe in your house, you want to have it folded up if it's a folding trike, and you just could roll it in to any corner and then move on, and then you have tons of extra space. Now let's go check out the hanging way to store it. Okay, so when you're storing it, this is about, I don't know, about six feet high. You wanna make sure it's high enough so that the boom doesn't touch the ground. I use the tear trike uh, wall hooks they're made of metal and they're super strong so that they could hold a heavier trike. They could even hold a trike that is motorized, which is really cool. And so you just hook it on the wall. Now a motorized trike is heavier to lift up that high. So I would actually do, if I had a motorized trike, if it was a folding one, I'd fold it, put it in the corner. Or if you don't have to fold it, that's even better. All right, and one of the last ways to uh, store your trike is to hang it up in the ceiling or in the rafters. And then we're just using this pulley system, something similar to what you would use for a kayak. And then you just pull it up off the ground. And that's a great way to store a trike. In this video, we talked about how to store your trike, but the next thing you wanna know is how to transport your trike. So go ahead and watch how to transport your trike video.